Hey everyone, Seattle Andrew here, and I've got the Pixel Chi version of the Notion Ink Atom, and I'm making a video response to my last HDMI video. Um, right now I'm running Pandora. Last time, I couldn't get it for the life of me to get Pandora's audio to work. But, as you can see, it's definitely working. So, that was just to show that off. Now, the next part of this video is I'm going to be answering some YouTube comments that have asked me questions. So the first one is to DJ Geese. Um, and I do have the screen protector on now. At the time of the video, I don't think I did. Um, but this makes it a matte display, so as you can see, like, the light sort of refracts off of it rather than just, like, a glare on the screen. Um, this is the standard skin that comes from Notion Ink, and it's pretty good, but I've scratched it, and that sucks, because that scratch is there for a long time, uh, at least until you replace it. In terms of how difficult is it to put it on, uh, I was an idiot and applied it by taking off the entire backing and then trying to put it on. Um, I have a couple of bubbles, like right there, right there, and there and there that have like dust trapped in them. It's kind of annoying. Other than that, it's not too difficult. It just, you're probably gonna have to do it 30 minutes if you don't do it right. So it may take a while just to get it right uh, and to look good. Other than that, the, the screen protector, I, I like it. It does muddle down some colors, but I'm okay with that because I don't like glare at all. So. Uh, the next question goes out to Della Gustin, who asked me about HDMI out in terms of video playing capabilities. Um, so I have four apps here. This is the standard video player, V player, Rock player, and Mobo player. So we're going to start with V player, and this is just the Big Buck Bunny. Man, I can't see that. The Big Buck Bunny 1080p video uh, that's often used to do demos. So, you can see right away that there's definitely a delay in sound. Um, or I shouldn't say sound, but the video is off. Um, now, part of that is each video player that you can get from the market uh, has uh, different sorts of things that you can do. And I was doing the best quality video, the highest speed, um, it, it still didn't work well. Uh, so that was V player. So let's try out Rock player. Unfortunately, the video player, I don't think it can play AVIs, so it sucks for it. It's not going to be able to join us. I need to go to this folder here. Actually, you don't need to see me poke around. Okay, and let's play the AVI. Now, I'm going to first start it in hardware decoding, and let's see how that one looks. So once again, this is 1080p video. And so far, it looks great, especially on this TV. I mean, you're, you're viewing it on my 1080p TV, and it looks fine. But if you haven't already noticed now, there's no sound. Um, yet, you can probably hear sound coming through there. So that's weird. 
So now, if we click this, let's try software. So, you, you can probably tell an issue now that the sound works, but it's not up to speed anymore. And it's actually slow video. This is 1080p, so can you blame it? But then again, it does have a NVIDIA Tegra chip, so it should be playing it faster. And it's playing just as slow on the tablet. So that's not a problem with HDMI. So, that was a rock player. Now we're going to go over to Mobo Player. In Mobo Player, let's check this out. Let's see if this works. So once again, fast video, but no audio. And I can try soft decoding. Ooh, that didn't last long. So, <laughs> the video is incredibly choppy uh, in terms of it's just slow. Audio is not even working anymore. Um, it's it's not a happy camper. Uh, maybe in settings, maybe there's something I can do. Um, no. So, in terms of which one was the best, I'll probably say Rock Player. Um, let me just go back. Uh, it does give you the option to do hardware or software, uh, and that seemed to work well. But, as you watched, it didn't do audio, which is really disappointing. Let's see if that works. And wait, I saw one more setting. Let's see, let's see if we can work through this together. Oh, oh wow. We have a lot of encoding modes. I have no idea what that means. Whew, okay. Well. Still, no sound. It's kind of disappointing because the video is working fine. Well, that's all I have for you in terms of 1080p video out. I mean, everything else works pretty much fine um, in terms of what you can pump out on the TV. So this is one of my favorite games, which is EVAC. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, I know, I know. So like, on the TV... This looks fine. And the audio works. So it's not a question of if audio works, it's... I guess in those video players, sometimes they just won't do audio, um, but it'll take some more investigation. It probably depends on each app uh, and how they process stuff. I'm still waiting for the VLC app. Uh, I'm almost certain that will work really well. Uh, VLC always pumps out really quality stuff. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'm Seattle Andrew. I know it's been long, but it's worth it.
Thank you.